Hey guys, it's me again. Welcome to the channel. If you're a new viewer, welcome back if you're an original viewer. <clears throat> I wasn't going to do a video this quickly, but something came up I wanted to talk to you guys about. Um, I'm a video game player. I have a PS4. I was playing a game and I started to talk to somebody that I'm friends with um, on PSN, PlayStation Network, for those that don't know. And the subject came up of something that we have in society today that ultimately I just don't get the point of, and that's bullying of any kind. You know, you've got face-to-face -face bullying where people make fun of you because of the way you look, the way you dress, uh, the way you talk, how much money you do and or don't have, what your parents do, things like that. Then you've got cyberbullying, you've got, um, I believe the term is weight shaming. I could be wrong with that one. Uh, excuse me. Sorry about that. Um, but yeah, I don't understand the point in any of it. I don't understand why anybody cares what anybody else looks like, does or has or doesn't have, so on and so forth. It makes no sense to me. You know, because for me personally, as an adult, as a, a grown adult, I don't care if you're straight, gay, black, white, Chinese, rich, poor, if you believe in God, the devil, or you're a fucking son of Sam believer that a dog was talking to him, giving him notions, whatever the case may be there. It, it doesn't matter to me because what you do in your life doesn't impact me in mind, so why should I care? And I don't understand why anybody cares what anybody else does. I mean, it's like all those people that read tabloids to see what celebrities are doing. What do you care? It doesn't impact you. What do you care just because you're watching them on TV? Nah, my dude, you don't know them, so what do you care? You don't know me. Why do you care if I have a beard or or if somebody's um, curvy or if someone's black or gay or whatever? It doesn't impact you. Why do you care? Why go out of your way to push their buttons and make fun of them and make them feel bad and, and just to make yourself feel good? That is pathetic. That's disgusting and pathetic, and I don't understand why somebody would do it just for the sake of making themselves feel better. I mean, there are people that I listen to talk on PlayStation Network. For example, if I'm playing Grand Theft Auto Online, I'll listen to these people talk, and they're just going off on people for no reason. It happened a few weeks ago, a month or two back. I was sitting there in a, a party chat room playing a game and I was listening to this guy go off on this kid for no reason and he was saying some bad, bad shit to him. And granted, this kid that he was talking to, he was firing back on him, defending himself. But the point is, there was no reason for it. This kid didn't do anything to him. Okay, I can understand if, if this kid said, hey, you know, fuck your mother. Your mother's a whore. Things like that. Forgive my language if you don't like cursing, by the way. But yeah, so I, I... If you were defending yourself against somebody that said something to you first, that's one thing. But if you, this kid didn't do anything to deserve the treatment that he was getting, so I don't understand the point in it. And then, you know, today I was speaking with this young lady that's friends with a friend of mine, and I've... I get along with pretty well. High Moon Shadow, if you ever see this video. Um, and she was telling me how this person that she was friends with just went off on her one day. Well, I don't think he was friends with, she was friends with him really. I think she just met him. And, you know, out of the blue, he went off on her and she asked him to stop and he wouldn't. So he, she, basically stood up for herself, defended herself, and he didn't like it, so he kept on going, blah, blah, blah. He, he told her to go fuck off, things like that, for no reason. So, in this day and age, 2016, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I just don't understand the reason for it. 
other than making yourself feel good, that's ridiculous. It's pathetic. In order to make this world a better place than what it is, we need to stop bullying. We need to stop with these people that bully people just to make themselves feel good. Like I said, if they're defending themselves against said person, that's one thing. But don't pick on somebody just because they're different from you. That's pathetic, it's disgusting, and there's no place in this world for things like that. So, hashtag stop bullying, I'm all for it, because when I was a kid, I was bullied, okay? I used to have curly hair because I'm mixed. I had curly hair, I mean, I shave my head now. My lips are full because I'm mixed, and I got made fun of, and, you know, I just, it, it, I know how it feels. I know how it feels, and I sympathize with people, although I'm, I'm not going to feel sorry for anybody because people need support, not sorrow, in my opinion. So, like I said, the subject of this video and the message is to stop bullying because it needs to come to an end. <clears throat> Sorry about that folks, I just had to change locations. But yeah, the like I said, we need to stop bullying because it's wrong, it's disrespectful, and it's not right to make fee people feel bad just to make ourselves feel better. I don't do it, like I said. The things that other people do in their lives don't impact me, and I don't care about it unless it impacts me, which it doesn't, so I won't. Okay? That's all the time for this video. Thank you for watching. Comment. I'll comment to everything as always. Good, bad, ugly. And as always, wherever you are, whatever time zone it is, be safe, be happy, have a nice time.